Hello my lovelies and welcome back to my 31 days of Halloween nail art. For today's set I'm using Madame Glam's colour Perfect Black to paint the base colour for all my nails. Each nail gets two coats of colour, curing in between each layer before applying matte top coat on all the nails and curing them for a final time. Here I'm just outlining the shape of the screen mask before I go ahead and fill it in with Madame Glam's Perfect White. I use a brush dipped in isopropyl alcohol to wipe away and neaten up all the edges of the mask. Before I cure this mask in my LED lamp, I go ahead and sprinkle white acrylic into the wet white gel polish. I tap off any excess and stick it into my LED lamp to cure it for a full two minutes. Once it's cured, I dust away any excess and neaten up the black area using isopropyl alcohol and a brush. Now on the back of a nail form, I draw an outline of a knife. For the blade, I use grey acrylic and for the handle, I use black acrylic. Once it's set, I peel it off the form backing paper and sculpt the back side of the knife to give it a more 3D roundness. Because this knife will be stabbed into the nail, I used old cuticle clippers to cut the blade down so I'll be able to use a bead of clear acrylic to secure this knife into the nail. I then used Madame Glam's Amour and a fine brush to paint blood around the base of the knife along with blood drips down the nail. All of the rest of the nails get random blood drips at the cuticle end of the nail. Once everything is cured, I add no wipe top coat to the blood area and cure for a final time. And here's my finished design. Let me know your thoughts on this set down below in the comments. If you like this video, be sure to hit the like button. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any videos I upload during my Halloween series. So that's all I have for you today. I'll catch you all here again tomorrow for the next episode of my 31 days of Halloween nail art. Bye!